Hi guys, how's it going? Today I want to speak about the subject of what concept could have the biggest positive impact on humanity. Well, this is going to be more personal way of thinking. But I do think that the biggest impact that we could have as human beings is kindness. And also the fact that within that kindness, we take out the greed. And that is a difficult thing because as human beings, we are animals, we are mammals. And as human beings, we often have this thing that we say, this is mine, this is yours. And we also have that fear of maybe not having the abundance that we want, be it in food, be it in cover, shelter. So we create these things, these boundaries, be it countries, be it property, be it you know, houses, be it uh, the possessions that we have, clothes, and <laughs> all these things. And kind of like when you have a pet such as a dog or a cat or whatever other kind of animal that you have, if you think about it, um, if you try to take food out of their mouth when they're eating, you can try to protect it, right? It's an instinctive thing. So we have this instinctive thing within our humanity that tells us that even though we can be kind, even though we can be generous, there's something that says, this is mine, this is yours. Uh, I cannot share this at this time. And if we could in some way get past that, and maybe also kind of understand that there's humanity in people that you don't even know, that there's humanity in, and more than humanity, there's a soul in pretty much everything around you, then we will finally be able to maybe overcome as a society because in some ways this world really definitely has an abundance of stuff. There's so many things that people throw away. There's so many things that go to waste. There's so many things that just uh, don't make sense. But yet there's people suffering. Yet there's people that don't have that abundance. But how can we live in a world of abundance and yet not be abundant as a human species? And that's where it gets really, really difficult. But I do think that if we could change that, it would take a lot of effort because it's not easy to control every person on Earth and have them think the same way. Um, you know, uh, yeah it's pretty much almost impossible, but maybe through um, the fact of education, the fact that we can uh, maybe spread out the word of kindness, happiness, and all these things, then maybe this abundance can at least be spread out to a majority of the world, and maybe through time, through decades, through centuries, um, we might become wiser as human species, and that's really, in some ways, what is going to stop us in the future if we can't take away that greed. If we can't take away that greed, then we might, um, you know, in some, at some point end up with nothing because, you know, how they have those dystopian movies where they show the end of the world. Well, it is a possibility. Technology is getting better, and uh, it doesn't take a huge amount or a huge group of people in order to destroy what we have here, all this comfort. So that's it. That's all I have to say on the subject. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.